A bodyguard is a type of security guard, government law enforcement officer, or service member who protects a person or a group of people, usually high-ranking public officials or officers, wealthy people, and celebrities, from danger, generally theft, assault, kidnapping, assassination, harassment, loss of confidential information, threats, or other criminal offenses. The personnel team that protects a VIP is often referred to as the VIP security detail. Most important public figures, such as heads of state, heads of government, and governors are protected by several bodyguards or by a team of bodyguards from a government agency, security forces, or police forces, in most countries where the head of state is also their military leader. The leader's bodyguards have traditionally been royal guards. Republican Guards and other military units. Less important public figures, or those with lower risk profiles, may be accompanied by a single bodyguard who doubles as a driver. A number of high profile celebrities in source also use bodyguards. In some countries or regions, wealthy people may have a bodyguard when they travel. In some cases, the security personnel uses an armored vehicle which protects them and the VIP. The role of bodyguards is often misunderstood by the public, because the typical layperson's only exposure to bodyguarding is usually in heavily dramatized action film depictions of the profession, such as the 2018 British TV series Bodyguard, in which bodyguards are depicted in firefights with attackers, in contrast to the exciting lifestyle depicted on the film screen. The role of a real-life bodyguard is much more mundane. It consists mainly of planning routes, researching rooms and buildings where the client will be visiting, researching the background of people that will have contact with the client, searching vehicles, and attentively escorting the client on their day-to-day -day activities. The role of a bodyguard depends on several factors. First, it depends on the role of a given bodyguard in a close protection team. A bodyguard can be a driver bodyguard, a close protection officer. Some bodyguards specialize in the close quarter protection of children of VIPs to protect them from kidnapping or assassination. In some cases, bodyguards also drive their clients. Normally, it is not sufficient for a client to be protected by a single driver bodyguard because this would mean that the bodyguard would have to leave the car unattended when they escort the client on foot. If the car is left unattended, this can lead to several risks. An explosive device may be attached to the car. An electronic bug may be attached to the car. The car may be sabotaged. The car may be stolen. Or city parking officials may simply tow away the vehicle or place a wheel clamp on the tire. If parking services tow away or disable the car, then the bodyguard cannot use the car to escape with the client in case there is a security threat. While the client is at their meeting, the driver should be trained in evasive driving techniques, such as executing short radius turns to change the direction of the vehicle, high speed cornering, and so on. The car used by the client will typically be a large sedan with a low center of gravity and a powerful engine. In some countries, large SUVs such as Chevrolet Suburbans are used for VIPs. At a minimum, the vehicle should have ballistic glass in the windows some type of armor reinforcement to protect the client from gunfire, and a foam-filled gas tank, run flat tires, and armor protection for the driver are also desirable. The car may also be equipped with an additional battery, dual foot pedal controls, such as those used by driving instruction companies, a PA system with a microphone and a megaphone mounted on the outside of the car so that the driver can give commands to other convoy vehicles or bodyguards who are on foot. Fire extinguishes inside the vehicle in case the vehicle is struck by an incendiary weapon. A reinforced front and rear bumper to enable the driver to ram attacking vehicles. And additional mirrors to give the driver a better field of view. In Latin American countries, many armored cars will come with a siren and lights to use in situations where they need to get out of places quickly. Decoy convoys and vehicles are used to prevent tailing. In the event the convoy holding the client is compromised and ambushed, decoy convoys can also act as a reinforcement force that can counterattack a force that is 
attacking the primary convoy. Some clients rotate between residences in different cities when attending public events or meetings to prevent being tailed home or to a private location. Depending on the laws in a bodyguard's jurisdiction and on which type of agency or security service they are in, bodyguards may be unarmed, armed with a less lethal weapon such as a pepper spray, an expandable baton, or a taser, or with a lethal weapon such as a handgun.